Hey guys, my name is Chidanesh Nuri and today we're gonna install the Sense 7 Marshmallow ROM for Galaxy S3 i9300 from A to K. And first of all, we're just gonna power off our device. And we're just gonna and we're just gonna wait for it to turn off and now we're just gonna go into the custom recovery and to do that we're just gonna press volume up key home key and power key at the same time and now we're gonna let go of the power key and as you can see that the phone is booting into the custom recovery and now we're gonna go in wipe advanced wipe and we're gonna select the delivery cache cache system data and if you wanna wipe your internal storage as well so you can select the internal storage and we're gonna swipe to confirm flash and now we're gonna go back and back and back and we're gonna go in install and we're gonna select the micro SD card because the ROM is in my micro SD card and there's the ROM A2, A2K Sense 7 OS and we're gonna swipe to confirm flash so the ROM does come with the aroma installer and I chose this ROM today because uh, I just wanted to see how the S3 looks when it is running the HTC Sense uh, UI. So we're just gonna go in HTC One Sense 7 A2K installation. And next. And now we're gonna go in, in install now. And it is now installing the ROM. So it took some time and it is finally done now. So we're just gonna press next and we're gonna reboot the device so I guess the ROM is now optimizing the app so we're just gonna wait for it so the device just pulled it up and we're just gonna set it up so first of all we're just gonna select English over here and I guess you can see this right now so I'm just gonna quickly set it up so that we can easily see this so there is a personalization option but you can't really see any personalization options right here so next and next and start and right out of the install as you can see that the wallpaper is really beautiful over here and let's get into settings so we're just gonna go in the about device and let me just deal with this uh, brightness and now we're gonna go in a bot device and as you can see that the android version is 6.0.1 which is the marshmallow and and as you can see that the kernel is enforcing so i think that's it and thanks for watching guys